Hello and welcome to this next episode of this Let's Play. Let's answer the question that's been on everyone's lips since last weekend. Who on earth is this weirdo in a costume? Let's go and visit King Kahuka's area arena. Let's go. And, uh, ah, so relaxing. Looks like we're traveling to a tribal island. And now he's doing a DT dance! DT HD! No! DT Gamer HD is featuring on this limit of Let Leg Road Races in the form of King Kahuka! Welcome to the Let's Play DT HD Game How do you feel? How do you feel? And your car looks pretty epic, by the way. And yes, it's the first time we got the boost! King Kahuka is probably the easiest of the bosses. Well, joint easiest along with Sam Sinister, but I'll explain why anyway. First of all, these tracks are probably some of the easiest in the game. Secondly, King Kahuka goes for shields constantly. But anyway, that being said, you should not find too much trouble in getting hold. And I'm not gonna, just going to boost for that. Oh, I just thought I'd have probably there my boost, but no, that's fine. Seriously, King Kahuka is like the, one of the easiest bosses of the game. It's, it's a steering like not as sensitive as it normally is. As I swear, it's not as sensitive. Uh, but oh well. Like, see, I can pull up such a massive advantage on this guy. It ain't even funny. I think I've only actually used like one warp at this point. Oh, there isn't one there, but I'm still uh, cutting the shortcut there anyway. Let's troll people like that, yeah. Just for fun. There we go. And I'm just going to go in the water, get that, and get my boost. Oh, and I think I've done something to him, so... Alright. Now, I'm probably going to win all these tracks anyway, but I'm going to try and make it so this is at least a bit interesting. Especially... Oh, no, 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 no. The bosses are way behind. The boss is way ahead. So I'm just going to win this anyway. Get to the finish line as quickly as possible. So, yeah. And I'm just... I'm using that all the time. Wow, I'm just cutting everything up. And let's use this. And I win. I win by a significant margin. And... Yeah. Seriously, King Kahuku is probably one of the easiest bosses in the game. He uses shields, he doesn't attack you, and usually just builds up like white bricks. So it doesn't really do a lot. And so that's why it makes him really easy, and the tracks aren't too difficult either. And the thing's pretty cool as well. I haven't really mentioned about that too much, but I do find this music really addictive. Also, I think there's a shortcut coming up, so let's just go in the shortcut, grab that, get the boost. Alright. Yeah, there we go. I just hit him. There we go. Oh, he, he used a green bit there. And I'm now going to do that and then do that. We're going to catch him. We're done. We missed him up. We really missed him now. Gonna catch him up. So that didn't really do anything. And I'm still training, but look, I'm not that far behind. And he failed! Ha ha ha! He got hit by the stone. DT Game HD got hit by the hammer. And now I'm just gonna run away. Look, I d have I used a warp yet this race? I have, I'm leading this race and I've yet to use a warp. You don't need a warp to win the race, but that's not the point. That is nowhere near the point that I'm trying to make here at all. There are three white bricks over there. And I'm just going to shoot. No, I'm going to be King Kahuka right now. Or DT Gamer HD. Oh, you can't use white bricks in the round. That's probably pretty clear by now. And now I thought, oh, I had to stop there. That means I made him catch up. But no, I've got the boost. And I've got a shield now. And now we're going to win a race. Only a few seconds ahead. But that's pretty much good achievement scenes. I didn't use a warp. 
I probably could have uh, been more significant without a warp anyway, but that's not the point. I win this, so that's pretty cool. Anyway, on to the third circuit, and this is probably my favourite circuit of the game. Or at least one of them anyway. And I got a boost when no one else got... Oh, I got shot. I don't care. Oh, King Hooker shot me. There's me boasting about his uh, thing. Oh my god, here I go again. Running through the coldy zone. Cold as sacks of oh, There is a beanbag running over my head. I am going to win this race for me and my best friends. I will. I'm going to win. I'm winning. Now. See, I'm going for the shortcut. I'm going for a shortcut. But when you go through this track. In fact, I'll show you next time I'm going around. Because it will be very obvious. Like that shortcut that I just went through. Would you go through that shortcut? Yeah. Or would you go the normal route? Now come on now. I'm just going to go up to that bit in a second here. And make you make the decision for yourself. That seems good. Yeah. And now here we go. Where would you go? Would you go around that circuit tells you to through this ice cave? You're always going to go through the ice cave. I swear down. Because that's far more appealing. Why didn't they just make... Uh, I don't get why they couldn't have hidden, hidden that. That's probably a minor annoyance by me is why they couldn't they have hidden that a bit more but anyway that's not for me to question this is this game is 18 years old 18 this year it's, it actually stands up pretty well for the most part I mean there's, there's minor annoyances here and there and I probably will talk about that in like a later episode but my god this is such a good game for like a game that's like 18 years old I love this game as a child, and I can totally understand why. This game is epic! I go out and warp. I'm miles in the lead. I'm not even trying at this point. I don't have to. Do you know what? I'm going to really show off. Yeah, I took my foot off the pedal. <laughs> well, uh, well, there wasn't really any point. I do love that track. That and the moon track from like the first circuit is very, really good circuits. And again, I've won the circuit with a race to go. That is pretty awesome. And now, this race. Bob! Time to go through the waterfall. I am through the waterfall. That's actually a shortcut. But it's kind of cliche. But yeah. Now, here we go. Hit that. Boost. There you go. And straight into a white brick. Straight into a green brick. And then. Then can I get this? Yeah. Warp. There you go. And yeah. And I've basically cut up the majority of the course. That's how it's done. Yeah, boy. Alright, I won't be able to get away with such now. But let's go around this bit. The bit I missed out on before is the water segment. And then up this a little bit. I actually did walk twice though, so that's pretty cool. Let's warp again. Now I've gone completely the wrong way. So I'm going to do a three point turn and make it two points. I make a three point turn, two points. But yeah, that really wasted the boost overall. Uh, I was just unlucky there. Oh dear. But that being said. Oh god. There you go. Alright, let's turn. Can I boost half at the no I can't boost at the waterfall. But the moment I get a green brick, I will be able to boost, so that's something. Not that that's important. I don't need to try at this point. I've already won. Like I've already won the circuit. I've pretty much won this race. I'm just about to cross the line in victory. Hitting that. And there's a the plane. And this is the victory for one and only Robotic Master in his randomly built car. Booyah! Yah, me hearties! I win again! I beat DT Gamer HD at his own game! At his own island! Far, far away from planet Earth! As you know, it's probably on planet Earth somewhere, because I'm playing on planet Earth! <coughs> God, that made myself cough. But, as a reward for beating King Kahuka, aka DT Gamer HD, we receive his car set and all the things that come with it as well. But again, in the next episode, 
Oh, we've unlocked a brand new circuit as well. In the next episodes, we're going to be building a brand new car using King Kahuka set. And we're going to be asking the really important question, who on earth is that random bat guy? Until then, guys, this has been Robotic Master, and I'm signing off.